How's it going with my friends? It's Anakis, and today I'm doing a review for Marvel Legends Game Reverse Atmosphere Armor Iron Man. This is from the Fix It Wave, which is still even a lot of people are finding this wave on clearance, and I got him for like twelve bucks at the local comic shop. But finding the whole wave still was like. Next to impossible. It was Thunderstruck, Kang, Jacosta, comic version of Falcon, another game reverse, Captain America. Uh, this was the Joe Fix It wave. But. Let's just go ahead and get him open. Not much I can say about him. He just looks cool. So let's just go ahead and get on to it. Okay, so here's the Atmosphere Iron Man out of the package. It looks good in the blue and the silver. Uh, arms can go 360. Can't do a T pose because of the armor, which is fine. There's a bit of an Where the hand just fell right out. There's, as you said, there's a bit of a upper arm swivel, but it's hampered by this shoulder pad. Double jointed elbows, and the hands can rotate and rock back and forth. You can go back and forth, up and down, that far. There's a rocker to go back and forth like that. And there's a waist swivel. Which is really good. I can go up that far. I want go back that far. Do a side kick. Upper leg swivel. Double jointed knees and just some movement in the feet. Goes back and forth, and rock back and forth, all that good stuff. It doesn't. Seem, it's not a bad Iron Man. It's actually really good. Kind of tempted on taking another look at that. Uh. That Abomination Wave Iron Man. That was a Game Reverse Iron Man. See the hands can come out to be the fists. Now I'm kind of worried about this one because it doesn't really have a Pop like that. It's not as I don't want to say profound, but it's not that strong. You got the alternate Tony Stark head. Pop that off. There we go. Pose them. Oh, there's, there's a way to. I'm holding the arm, the helmet. It's better than that. There you go. Not so bad. It's still not a bad figure. 
I'll do that detailing all the armor. The grays and the blues really look nice. They really pop. I like them. And the head sculpt looks pretty good. It's not a Robert Downey Jr. head sculpt, but it's what you expect of a Tony Stark. Got this light beard, goatee. It's pretty good. This comes of course with a fix it arm. But uh no blast effects, which is different for an Iron Man usually has the blast effects, but does have holes for the blast effects. So you can take them from like other figures and Attach them to it. I thought I had a... Here we go. There we go. That looks pretty good. Oh, I think it would probably be a little more on the bluer side. Ulcer Blast would make more sense. Oops. But, uh, overall, not a bad figure. Only issue I have is, uh, Looseness of uh, this hand. But overall, good figure. I give it a good 8.5. It's definitely worth picking up, especially on clearance. Do like this video give me a thumbs up down below like share and subscribe like the bell for notifications and uh let me know so far what's your favorite iron man armor it seems like every wave we get a marvel legends we're getting a new iron man armor or anything that's not iron man or not a spider-man or x-men but let me know in the comments down below. Like, share, subscribe, like the bell for notifications. If you said all that already, just remember to keep hitting those toy aisles. And I'll see you guys next time. Later.